guys welcome back to another tutorial in this tutorial uh, I'm gonna discuss about how we we'll, uh, disable this button so how can you we'll disable this button simply calling this another property name like that btn btn disable then it's true when it it's true then it will be totally disable here and simply uh, cut it here or you can just simply copy this and paste it here okay then simply cut it from here btn then you, you can use it simply bbind here bbind bbind and call this name property like the disable disable simply use it btn disable ok so that's it and you will get this error btn disable here so simply oh here here is a mistake and in the last video uh, i told it about this issue okay okay remember it and you will show that uh, this is the click button and another button uh, looking like disable so this is the disable button function okay so basically this is the tutorial and uh, today i will finish this tutorial and i hope you will enjoy this tutorial so if you like my video then obviously subscribe my youtube channel thank thanks for watching see you soon in the next tutorial